Hello everybody, my name is Ketemar, welcome back for another video of Star Wars The Old Republic. We're gonna continue this series. We gotta use our ship's intercom right now. I'm figuring out that uh, probably what's gonna happen is we're probably gonna uh, invite Skaj in, right? Uh, show him up to everybody. Yeah, we got actually gotta talk to him. He does want to talk to him, Mako as well. Before we uh, do the ship's intercom then, I might as well just... Uh, talk to Mako and uh, Sketch really quick. Uh, we're probably gonna just uh, show him up to uh, the family, I guess. Right, Mako, what's going on? Have a few minutes? Maybe you could give me a few pointers on my pistol technique. Yes, I can spare a minute. About time you practiced. Well, I guess I can. Pr I guess I can spare a few minutes. Doesn't hurt to get some practice in. It won't take long, I promise. Because actually, I just wanted to show off. I've, I've got a new shot and I can't wait for you to see it. In fact, I'm sort of looking forward to seeing it in action myself. Is that it? So what do you think? Let's put it to use, not bad. I've seen better. Nah, it's not bad. You're getting pretty good. Thanks. Let's move. I kind of want to shoot something now. I'm kind of throwing away the whole uh, romantic options and everything. Uh, I don't want to piss off Torian uh, since Torian made a move. I was move making a move first, but uh, since Torian decided to go for it, I'm gonna let him go uh, for Mako, boys. I don't really care that much for her, so I'm just gonna let him go and do his thing. The digs ain't much to look at. At least it's roomy. What do you do for fun in this dump? Not your host, not much, nothing, <laughs> actually not much. Honestly, I go out for my entertainment. Don't think you're gonna keep me cooped up in this can with nothing to do. On the inside, I got bored, somebody got stabbed, better keep me busy. Don't push your luck. Well, that's fine. Whatever keeps you quiet, psycho. You're too kind, wimp. <laughs> this guy is talking about killing one of my companions. I don't care. As long as it's not Mako or Torian, alright? Well, actually, you can kill Mako. I don't care, but don't kill Torian. He's my favorite. Alright, let's uh, use the intercom already. Everybody front and center. You didn't mention we had a guest. Who's our large friend? It's our new muscle. There we go. Three meters of short fuse. That's what that I can say about me. him. I suggest everyone get acquainted. I'm Skadge. Skadge. Okay, interesting. Call me Mako. Skadge friend of boss. Skadge friend of Liz. Interesting way. Skadge. Don't you worry. I've got it committed to memory. So what's next? Well, we still have work to do. Get the house settled. I'm taking a break. You know what? We still have work to do. Torment still has a target for us to deal with. You've been a busy boy. Too busy. You should spend more time with your loved ones before they're gone. What are you I'm talking about? you an invitation. An opportunity to appreciate what you have before you lose it. But if the boy's less close to you than we thought, it really doesn't matter. There'll be plenty of other opportunities for us to meet. If you want a chance to say goodbye, Come to Hoth. We won't wait long. What is he talking about? Torian, we've got to save him. Torian? He got captured? I was wondering why I wasn't seeing him. We're bluffing. I'll get him back to you. This is a trap. That's exactly what they want. They seem to be smart. They won't toss their bait until they're sure we won't bite. I know, but we have to do something. We don't have to so do what shit. Are we gonna do? This, uh, this can't be rushed. We get Torian back. 
That's these idiots. This can't be rushed, man. The deck stacked against us. We need to be prepared for the worst. You're right. We've only got one shot at this. Just don't wait too long, okay? So we do have to go to off anyways, I guess. So we're going to another high sea planet, boys. I hate off. I I think we already went there before, but I now we gotta go back there again. I really don't like this planet, so this is not gonna be good. It's not gonna be fun, boys. But we have to do it. Let's go back to off to s to try and rescue our good old friend Torian right here. I like Torian, he's my favorite companion, but I'm not gonna go, even for him, I'm not gonna go out of my way to just rescue him. I don't necessarily need him. Like, uh, there's no point in me trying to waste my time rescue a guy. Alright, let me just go ahead and, uh, go there to the rendezvous point, I guess. Alright boys, I think we are in the location we're supposed to rendezvous at. It took me about fucking like 20 minutes to travel there, 20 to 25 minutes. Well, I'm ex probably ex I'm exaggerating, but it's at least 15 minutes. It's a it's a lot, all right. I had to uh, take a taxi, but then I had to travel on foot afterwards because there's no actual taxi close to this place. So, well, it's off, right? This is why I hate the planet. Fucking ice everywhere, the snow everywhere, just like my uh, real life. Uh, my Earl uh, life, so pretty ridiculous. I hate it for the life of me. Plus, the the map is way too huge. I don't know, boys. This map is way too. I was huge. starting to think we'd have to finish without you. All right, what do you want exactly? Why? Look, I'm here. What do you want? Cut the garbage. I want an explanation. I can give you that much. But I don't like raising my voice. Keep walking. Ambush, run! An ambush, huh? Not really surprising, to be honest. I kind of was Point expecting that. Anything your friend doesn't already know. You know, Grand Champion, you've got talent. The Overseers would have scouted you eventually. We could have helped you make a real mark on the galaxy. Now you'll have to settle for your gaudy title and the price on your head. Oh, is that what it is? The price on my head, huh? Is that all? Who's we? Last chance, walk away. <sighs> Actually, no complaints here. Better than the mark you're about to make in the snow. Winning that great hunt really inflated your ego. Bounty hunting isn't a game, whatever the Mandalorians think. It's serious business, with serious consequences. Consequences you're about to become intimately familiar with. Alright, let's do this. The fight let's go you've got little baby baby health what do you want to what do you hope to do against me buddy you're not gonna do shit all right i'm gonna equip my shield really quick and i'll show you how about i just do that to you there we go but now you can't do shit there we go you're weak you're weak little baby man what are you what is he trying to do right here what is i trying to prove really taking down the great even with all these friends of yours and not never going to be able to defeat me that was a bad plan by your part right there. All right, what do you want? You really think you can take me on? Let's go. Oh, I'm waiting for you, buddy. How about a little bit of that? There we go. And this as well, and you're gone. See, I've got a muscle man with me right now. I've got Scout with me, which I might take always. He is, let me see real quick. Scout is a melee probably. Yeah, he's a melee dude. He's just like Torian, but a little bit more uh, threatening, that's for sure. I owe you. Again. My turn to be bait, I guess. Well, you got my attention, that's for sure. Bet they wish they hadn't caught me now. Loser's bet. This one ain't dead. Yet. How? This should have been total overkill. Overkill? What are you talking about? Do you know who I am? Despite what you think, the Great Haunt's no joke. I'm used to having the odds stacked against me. If this couldn't kill you, I don't know what would. I want out. I don't care how good the money is. It's not worth it. You can't be the, a living deterrent. That's up to my friend here. Well, you know the risk. Well, that, that's up to my friend, actually. You're begging the wrong person. Your call. You went too far. 
Hey, it's all Torian. Torian wants Finished. to wants to kill him. All right, let's go. Grab your gear and get a move on. Killing's over. Wait for us back at the ship. I'll find something on the way. This cat is just disappointed. There's no more killing to do. All this guy. All right then. Let's go back to my ship, boys. No, uh, no time to waste here. I just traveled for 20 minutes just to do a simple battle like that. Frustrating, but it is what it is. That's what this game is all about, right? I wish they would add an option, though, to just simply refuse to to rescue you or your companion, right? What happens if you just refuse to you just say, ah, oh, fuck it, I'm not going to rescue him. And then he just gets killed or, or something like that, right? And just lose him permanently. And the, 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 the people that the captured him are like, well, shit. I guess he doesn't care about his companion. What happens? Like, that should be an option. I know there's... It's an MMO, so already there's the most amount of options you could possibly have. But still, there's some interpretations, some stuff that are left to be desired that you would really want to have uh, moved on to the next level. I wish someday there would be a game like this where basically you have all the options, right? You got uh, the dialogue options and you got the choice, the real choices, determinant choice that you can do so if a companion gets captured you can choose to not ca uh, not rescue him just completely ignore the situation it's a, it's gonna be like a side quest you can go to off to rescue him but it's, it's optional and it's uh, over time so if you waste too much time w without uh, trying to save him then that option is off and he basically gets killed or whatever that should be an option that should just be a thing, boys, because that would make the game so much more living and a lot more options and replayable overall. That's just me. I just think that more options is always better, but uh, it is what it is. I'm, I've run well enough, boys. Let's just talk to Torian right here. He'd be glad that I saved his ass. Never thanked you. Not making a big deal over me taking off. Good to see my brothers are still alive. Cordan owes me 50 credits. You ought to collect that. Never leave a debt, Torian. He's good for it. Been meaning to ask something. Mandalore offered you a place in his clan, didn't he? Why'd you say no? They want to be tied down? Don't know, really. <sighs> well, it's none of your business, actually. That's between me and Mandalore, isn't it? Guess so. Uh, yeah, that's really none of his business. Let's, uh, he wants to really talk to me, okay. Ever eaten Mandalorian food? After you won the Great Hunt, maybe? No. I don't think so. You remember it. Eddie class, Nelsburn. That's how you know it's good. Thought I'd put something together next chance I got. Interested? Well, you know what you're doing? Well, sure, why not? I Whatever. Turn down a hot meal. Let you know next time I'm headed to the galley. Whatever, if you want to make me food. That's, that's all it was? Alright then. What a waste of time, boys. What is he doing? Alright then. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, use my intercom already. There's, I've got a feeling this video is not going to be about too much. Glad to see you both at this rate. Okay. That is the last time I let you go off without a chaperone. Looks like I'm grounded. Be back on the hunt? Uh, yes, not yet. We've wasted enough time. This is no excuse to slack off. One of Tormund's lackeys forwarded a star chart to a system called Voss. The place isn't even on most maps yet. There's a lot of scuttlebutt about Voss's discovery on the holonet, but it's pretty far-fetched stuff even for spacer superstition. The astrogation computer's updated and ready to go when you are. Alright, looks like we got uh, the new place. We are go we're going to Voss. Voss is around the, if not the the last, or if not the uh, one of the last uh, places that you go for the your main story, I, I think, right? So, I think we're coming up towards the end of the story, actually, which is pretty interesting. I didn't think we were this close, but uh, here we go. Scott, you want to talk to me again? You got crummy taste in company. I don't and choose my company, they choose me. And the little twerp trying to walk tall. 
I don't get how that squeaking thing in the belly aching dandy ain't become target practice yet. How'd a hard case like you get tangled up with such a bunch of dainties? They have uses? Well, doesn't matter. Just lucky, I guess. Yeah, lucky. None of your tagalongs would have lasted two minutes with any of my crowd. You're done? You had a crowd? Yeah, you're probably right. That's a generous estimate. Figure they'd take their time. Had a good thing going back on Coruscant. The Empire shook that place up real good. No law. Just unclaimed turf. And millions of dregs clawing at each other for the scraps. One big round-the-clock brawl. <sighs> Shame it didn't last. Why? The Republic sent in the troops. Uh, Pagan order got sorted out, gangs formed, party ended. Still, turf wars were fun. My gang was top of the pack. Black Sun were killers to the core. Not like those lazy, stinking huts. Wonder what they've been so. doing since they got nabbed. Gotta go find me something to break. Damn, alright then. Chill out. Okay. We got a couple of influence here. Now another thing I would like very much is uh, if you're disapprove, like there's a companion disapproves and approves thing, right? That should be, uh, me that should mean something or it doesn't mean anything. It actually doesn't mean anything. I haven't found anything that it uh, has a worth meaning f uh, for it, right? So I'm thinking this should add the thing where if you really disapprove, he disapproves too much. Uh, because you got the thing where you can uh, create a romantic level with anyone, really. You can be in a romantic relationship with anyone you want at a certain point. It should be the same thing, but for the contrary, where you piss off someone too much, he just leaves. That happens in the DLCs and the new missions and everything, but in the main campaign, they should update the main campaign, the main thing, the main route. So if you really piss off at one of your companion too much he just ups and leaves and says fuck you to you i guess i don't it should be a thing but i'm i'm just saying all these options i'm bringing up to the table they're easy things easy things to fix for the game i don't it's not that i don't like the game i love the game but it's just easy fixing i don't know why torian by the way has this helmet the right color but when it comes down to the actual cutscenes or whatever, it doesn't have the the right color of the, of the helmet. I don't like. I don't know why. Am I uh, interrupting you? On a new shot. Something I picked up watching you. Want to check it out? Ah, uh, sure. Whatever. Let's see it. Think it'd be best to try it in a real firefight. Let's get to work. The sooner we're moving, the sooner you can see me in action. That's kind of cool, actually. So he does have a new gun. The Empire graciously welcomes you to Vos Orbital. Ambassador Yoran deeply regrets that he was unable to greet you personally. I've been instructed to emphasize the delicate situation you're walking into before you head for the surface. The Ambassador is concerned that your business could jeopardize the Empire's interests on Vos. Oh, is he now? Well, he does, has no worry, no worry to uh, worry about my business, all right? My business is my own. I'm actually on Imperial business. My employer would argue otherwise. It's just that your kind aren't known for stepping lightly, you understand. The Voss are stubbornly isolationist and abundantly aware of their own value to the Republic and the Empire. It is vital that the Empire fosters goodwill. What do I care about you the Voss? remain on your best behavior. It won't be any problems. Uh, you can't stop harping on it. Why are they so important? Actually, you know what? There won't be any problems. I'll conduct myself accordingly. It's the nature of your profession that has the ambassador concerned. The Voss abhor discord and don't tolerate violence within their territory. You'll mix peacefully with the enemy here. The Voss revere their mystics. Deal carefully with them, or, or preferably not at all. Also, outsiders are barred from Voskar proper. Okay. Oof. That's a little bit too much. Mystics... Who, what do I care about mystics and Vasca? I'm not a Jedi. I'm a bounty hunter. This is a device or a lecture. Should I be taking notes? No, no. Those are the only specific points. Just use common sense. 
I will let Ambassador Yoran know to expect you. Head to his office once you've landed. Have a safe visit. Ready then, already. Oh, you're disturbing the peace. Ain't that a shame? Yeah, that's kind of a shame, isn't it? Don't jeopardize my job itching to get arrested. Try to behave. I'm not busting you out of prison again. Ain't nobody gonna put me away. All right, let's go. All right, Skadge. I'm trusting you for this one. I kind of want to test you out as a companion. Uh, you're you're the same as Torian anyways, a melee guy, so might as well use him. There's no uh, real difference here. I kind of like the melee. Uh, oh, guys, they are really useful. So this is the these are the ones I want to use. Let's go, boys. Let's go to uh, to Vas, I guess. And this is interesting. Uh, an ambassador, or, well, not an ambassador, just one random dude speaking for the ambassador on his behalf, really. Telling me that uh, I shouldn't do this and that. Like, shut the fuck up. I'm going to do whatever I want. But Voss is, uh, I'm going to tell you right now, Voss is my uh, preferred planet. It's my um, best planet, the, uh, the one I like the most. Just because of the the way it looks and everything. It looks beautiful. You came promptly. Thank the stars. The less time you spend mixing with the locals, the better. I trust my aide was quite explicit in informing you of the need for discretion here. I'll stay out of trouble. Don't worry about it. Actually, you know what? Not well, no. I'm not going to say that. Let's just I'm say that one. I'm always a professional. I have my doubts. Your reputation precedes you. That said, I look forward to being rid of General Redbush. That woman will be the death of me if you aren't. My mark is a general? How so? What's she doing that's causing you so much grief? That woman's charm has stalled an entire team of my most skilled negotiators for months now. The Empire has lost a number of newly conquered worlds due to her interference, and we may well lose this one unless she's removed. Unfortunately, we're going to have to take the roundabout course. Push her into the open. I do run about all the time. Okay, so yeah. The caliber of targets I deal with usually takes some groundwork to get to. Good. Then I've got an idea where you can start. Imperial intelligence suspects that she's behind the guerrilla attacks on our forces here, but we can't prove it. I believe your best course of action would be to root out General Redwish's officers in the field and gather evidence of her involvement. All right, this is a bit too much. You wanted me to deal with her? Just let, tell me to kill her. You don't need to tell me to just spy on her, waste time going 20 minutes uh, looking for her. Like, just tell me to kill her and that's going to be done. I'm going to be off Voss in no time. Like, chill out, dude. I'll cost extra. That's for My sure. job is to deal with General Redrish, not clean up after her. Fine, here. Yeah. I spend enough of my hours haggling without having to do it with you. I'm afraid casualty reports are all we have to go on. You'll have to search around the ambush points for signs of the enemy. Take this hollow recorder. If you make any discoveries, transmit the evidence to my frequency. <laughs> A waste of my talents, I can tell you that. I'm overqualified for this job. Keeping a low profile for once isn't going to kill you. All right then. So I've got to go uh, look after our target's woman for some reason, which is a target too. So, hey, he's paying me extra for this. I'll do it, I guess. What kind of waste of time in my opinion, but hey, we'll do it if he's willing to pay, I guess. Gather the map data. Let's go Eagle ahead and do that. We gotta business. go there. Gonna do this quickly. I don't know how long I want this video to be. I probably 30 minutes like always, but it's hard with my recording and everything. It's hard to figure it out, right? How long it's gonna be. So about uh, maybe uh, 50 minutes or 45 minutes of recording should do the trick. I don't know, boys. I'm at 35 minutes right now. It's because of all the traveling and stuff and all the skipping I gotta do, the transitioning. It always uh, s uh, slows me down for sure. We gotta look at it. Alright, so it's around the area. We're in the right area right now. We just gotta look really quick. So, ambush points. What is that? Signal fire? Is that what I'm supposed to uh, to look, take a look at or whatever? I ain't entirely sure. Gather map data. I gotta look around right now and try to find what I'm searching for. 
which I have no idea what it's supposed to look like. Is it uh, on one of the... Okay, so let me see real quick. Do I have to kill people? Because of us... Uh, find the general skirmishers and search them for evidence. General skirmishers, okay. So I guess I gotta kill these guys. I gotta kill them. Alright, let's go then. Let's go. Scadge, it's your lucky day. You get to kill a bunch of people. A bunch of soldiers with five soldiers and stuff. So I'll do that. I think I gotta search these guys. I'm not sure. I think this is it's a sergeant. Does he have what I need? No. Alright, what I I just kill him for no reason then? What Oh the skirmishers. There it is. There they are. There's one. Okay, so this is the guy I'm supposed to search right here. This is the one boys. Let's go. He's gonna have what I need. Hopefully more than one or I'm gonna have to kill more, I guess. I don't care really. As long as I get what I need. Yeah, only one. Okay, so I gotta kill multiple skirmishers. Is there one uh, nearby? There is. There is one nearby. Alright, boys. Let's go. Let's go fight. Let's do this shit. Let's go. Alright. It's gonna kill a bunch of Republic soldiers, boys. Yeah, boss is in a full-out war right now. Uh, trying to figure out both sides are trying to have this planet on their side or the populace on their side because there's some type of mystics that can prove that can basically uh, get the future right they see the v uh, they have visions about the future and everything and it's kind of all over the place I wouldn't trust them but uh, I mean the other the two sides seems to really want to trust them for some reason let's go boys let's get uh, rid of them already I'm actually gonna use this so I can do more damage with my gun. Do this and uh, yeah, just uppercut him to death. We're good. And now we got all the map. They, they don't know. All right, now we got it. Okay, so infiltrate the Republic base, which is over there. It's not that far away actually. Yeah, that's pretty good. Let's go, boys. You can see how uh, why I love this planet uh, and why it's my favorite, just because of. Look at how it looks, really. It's like we're in spring or not a spring, autumn all the time. That's what this planet is all about. It looks beautiful. It's like we're in October and November, early November. It just looks beautiful. I, I love the colors and everything, different colors for the grass, for the trees. It has its own uh, real value, this planet, that's for sure. The populace of it itself, the uh, Vasca and the, the CD and all this shit and other people i don't like them but um the actual planet itself it's it's by far my favorite that's for sure all right you should wear an helmet my guy i don't know why you're not wearing helmet right now but you're making a huge mistake all right, let me just go ahead and do that do this like this and more fire next up we gotta kill more of you i will you're all in my way right now well get out of my way Let's go. Kill that guy, and uh, that guy's about to be dead. So are you, buddy. And just throw a bomb in at his face. Man, this is a pretty far away. I gotta get. Yeah, I can't even use my speeder because uh, or my rocket right now because I gotta get past these guards first. I don't have anything uh, to hide myself from them, so I don't have a choice really. I gotta do it. Let's go got that i want to see what these do over a, a ride i that doesn't do anything that's just a bunch of bonuses i guess all right then let's continue on our way we're gonna shoot my way through a lot of people what the hell good lord all right yeah, the republic has escaped uh well in hand let me just go ahead and do this go ahead and do that as well a little bit of fire everywhere all right we're good Let's go. Next stop, we gotta go to this cave. All right, I gotta shoot my way through all these guys. Seriously now? All right, we're there, boys. There's people waiting for us. Let me just kill that guy real quick. Because uh, we already know we're gonna have to. So you, you might as well kill that little ambush they've got for me. Uh, excuse for an ambush. Let's go ahead and uh, get that done. Let's go. We got a bunch of stuff that we gotta deal with right now. So many uh, troops I had to kill, by the way. Ridiculous. Two specialists for the price of one, huh? Is it my birthday or something? What is going on here? Let's go. 
All right, you're all dead. Leave me alone already. Perimeter, report. Perimeter. Those charges, Prime Sergeant. Yo, I had to kill all of them, my guy. They were in my way. You're out of time. Yes, yeah, Sergeant. Those charges primed yet? Car, that was fast. No time. Hit them with everything we've got. Oh, is that so? Is that how it's gonna go? All right, then. You choosing death? That's quite uh, interesting. Let's go. All right, we're we're gonna actually kill this guy first. I've got the shield on right now. Got this little uh, thing. Gives me more damage for the gun and everything. But he's healing himself. I can't allow that to happen, buddy. Now you're good. You're dead. Next up. Let's activate this auto terminal right here. We got uh, a bunch of things to do. Hey, we got the, all the mines and stuff about it. The communications equipment has suffered from curiosity sabotage. Okay. What you want with that trash? Uh, I want to be sure it won't blow. Could it be info in the memory? Not trash. Pay dirt. Says you. Keep me waiting to get back to the murdering part. Chill out, dude. Okay, so terminal appears to be repairable. Attempt repairs, inspect the data night. Remove the charges. Attempt no. Remove the charges. More wires, just what I needed. Of the charges place, only a small number appear to be wired and are easily dis disconnected. Sorry about that. Nest compromise. Full retreat. Operation cave in underway. Final transmission. Carrier one out. Interesting. Carrier one to Peregrine. The garrison at Fort Cadenth appears to be sending out patrols of Imperial troops. Flights recalled and circling. What's the situation, General? Please advise. Peregrine has to be General Redrish. Pretty much. Our Carrier target. One. Expect more. Yorin's convinced the boss to allow Imperial troops to bolster Voskha's defenses against the Gormak. Monitor their patrols. If they stray too far, show the Vos how ill-prepared Imperials are for Gormak attacks. Peregrine out. Seen a lot of guns get booked on less. I've got something for you. Transmitting now. Now, what have we here? Oh, this is better than I could have hoped. I might even convince the boss to hand her over for trial with this. Okay, this is not really fun. You mean hand her over to me, right? Don't even think about taking credit for this. If your actions here lead to General Redrish's downfall, you'll have more than earned your due. I'll handle things from here. Return to my office and lay low until I return. Fine by me, I guess. All right, then we got that done for whatever I'm going to take. Just take uh, any of them. Doesn't matter. I'm not equipping, equipping them. Return to the ambassador's office, which is which is near enough. Uh, not here. It's at the first place, right? It's at um, uh, this place, Imperial District. So let me just travel there real quick. Hunter, have you returned? Oh, never mind. It doesn't matter. Whatever you're doing, stop. I need you here immediately. Really? Where is here exactly? I can move as soon as you give me a destination. I'm at the assembly hall on recess from our hearing. The boss have agreed to hear the accusations I've made against General Redrish, but they've also agreed to her request to face her accuser. She named you specifically to be called to account and submit to questioning. Excuse me? Um, that's probably bad. Ah, uh, you know what? Forget it. I'm done with this job. I think uh, I'm in I'm enough trouble as it is. Put up with this garbage. If you don't show, the boss will likely dismiss our grievances. Do you want General Redrish or not? Nah, I'll do it if you stop crying. Guess I have no choice. Well, make this dwarf, I guess. Give me a reason not to just shoot her when I get there. You may have me over a barrel bounty hunter, but remember, you can only bleed me for so much. I'll pay your protection money if you just get here and behave yourself. This is the assembly hall's location. Hurry, I don't want the boss to think we're stalling. This is a perfect trap for me to get attacked again. I've got a big, huge bounty on my head, my guy. Do you not remember that? I can't just be in assembly halls and stuff. This is ridiculous. This guy's. 
He's a retard, boys. I'm gonna tell you right now. All right. Um, I think I'm gonna end the video right here. We'll do that in the next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, boys. Keep it easy.